Okay, so the data originally uh, came out of big series uh, from uh, Spain, uh, which were the first people to study this issue. And um, the uh, if the patient was 35 or, or, or less, uh, you'd have a, about a 94% chance of at least one baby if you had 30 eggs. But when you get up to 37, we don't have clear uh, data on that, but we would have to extrapolate and imagine that uh, to have that same success rate with 37 year old eggs as opposed to 35 or younger uh, would probably mean 40 eggs. That is not to, that you could have several babies from that. It's just, it's that's the percent chance of about 94% of having at least one baby. Uh, and uh, you might have two or three, but the chance of having at least one baby uh, would require, uh, if you're 37, uh, not, I think more than 30 eggs, closer to 40 eggs. And uh, if we don't know what your ovarian reserve is, if we do minimal stimulation, we'll get the same amount of eggs we've discovered. It's just that there'll be better quality with a much higher baby rate per egg. Uh, so it could be better than those figures. Uh, it might mean that for 37, we'd only need half as many because we get better quality eggs with minimal stimulation. So, so we could go for anywhere from 20 to 40 eggs, and then I think you'd feel pretty secure.